we got some more art to do. This will be the last of these uh, kind of live sessions because I don't do have I don't have any live sessions actually. We're just going to do 32 minutes. So here's what I have. Uh, at this point, you can see uh, I added a pink uh, shape here. There's some visor. Now, um, what I'm going to add here are pinks. Um, she is an alien. Uh, Lita is. So what I would like to do is add a bit of um, pink uh, color or pink uh, shading uh, with blue blood or actually blue complexion. So let's add these two colors. Uh, these two colors are rose and magenta. We start with rose. We'll go about 32 minutes. Not too much white there, but just enough to um, give us something here. So the idea is to kind of introduce blue in here. Now what I may have to do is actually put in some white out because I don't have a uh, pink paint. I'm just thinking right now, as I always do. I'm distracted by stupid things outside and inside the house. You ever see possums outside in your yard? I, um, I'll see possums every now and then. I didn't see any tonight, but I, I wonder about that. It's not easy doing this, is it? Because then you have to get the colors right. Because what's happening here is that her, it's, um, I have to wait a bit. Let's see what I got here for pinks. We've got uh, a few colors. But I'd say no more than these three. So let's see what I can do here. So let's try to bring this closer, actually, and make it a lot easier. But I wanted to show you the overall size of this. Because remember, it's not rectangular. It's not portrait or landscape. It is actually a record album square. So let's see what we can get here. And we can get as much as we can to get done. Somebody was asking me about the um, World of Warcraft. And uh, if you're watching this, um, yeah, the, so I said in the comments that World of Warcraft is off fine for 80 bucks if you can spend it. For an additional 20 to $30, you can get Dungeon Academy and then maybe spend about 5 to $10 on little figurines. And what you want to do is build an alliance. Like uh, when Varen Wynn, the king, the, the fallen king, had gotten an alliance. And uh, he got an alliance to fight the, uh, the undead and the lich king. Because you need an army of soldiers to fight them, right? So you would put the soldiers in the spaces where the ghouls would uh, start to come in. And it's very similar to um, when you build keeps and um, settlements in Catan. Every time you build one, or yeah, every time you build one, then you go through the uh, pool 
and get a wildling token and you put a wildling and all the wildlings start uh, building up in there. So that's what would happen. So what I have to do here right now is build this. Um, now what I think I might have to end up doing, I think I'm gonna need the lavender pencil. And do I see it in here? I do see one. All I need is, oh, for fuck's sake. Now I see this is the problem with a lot of color pencils. There's no fucking way to mark this. So this is where I have to get up and get a goddamn sharpener. And we're at five minutes. substitute and I'm, I'm not seeing a substitute for my sharpener. This is where we must turn on 10,000 lights to find things, right? Because fuck me, why can't I have what I want, even if it doesn't cost anybody else? It's a simple thing. Let me have my damn sharpener. So it's like all production must halt. So let me pause this video actually, because that's bullshit. All right, continuing on, seven minutes in. I had to stop everything, stop the universe for the damn sharpener. And I don't like doing that. I actually don't. I don't like stopping everything for one butt fucking thing that I have to, you know, I, I, it's productive time, right? When you want to get, oh, what, what is this shit? No, no, no. Give me some of this, Mark. I need some of this. Whatever it has to take. Oh, for fuck. I get punished. I'm somehow getting punished. You know, I don't like to get fucking pissed for this fucking bullshit, but I need to have some kind of pencil mark. It's essential if I'm going to be doing these things. What, what is happening? Ten galaxies, what's happening here? Okay, I need to make sure that blends in better because that is not blending in. Uh, okay, we need, I need more of that. That's terrible. That's not blending in. We need to make sure it does blend in. You can waste six hours trying to find a simple thing. It is actually possible. Six seconds can turn to six hours, six days, six months to find one fucking thing that you are trying to find to speed this along. Because why can't you have, right? All right, let me try to... We're going to use some of the pink. I'm going to use the darkest... Magenta right now because okay. I'm going to try to use some of these goddamn colors because
what I'm trying to do is make it a little more seamless. I'm trying to look at it right now. So it's it's tough. I'm trying to get it to to be the way I want it. Okay, what I would like to do is probably use a little bit of blue to blend that in. Because remember, her skin color is pink. So how do you compare her skin color? Um, so you look at like um, certain crabs and you look at octopus or octopuses, I guess that's, the, you could still say octopuses. And you try to look at how their uh, skin color is like a bluish at the end. I don't know, that's, that's how I would go about doing this. Okay. Now, I'm gonna try to finish her hair, I think, before I do anything more. Um, do I have my damn pencil? I know where it is. I think it's still in the living room. Let me try to bravely go in there. And hopefully, I don't regret that decision. All right, in order to do this right, what I have to do is kind of have an idea as to what her hair overall looks like. Remember, it's short hair, but she just has this one hair that hangs off to the side. Um, I'm trying to picture it, and I use this. Now I'm just like I'm still lightly drawing in a little bit of laziness of drawing. Let me see. Okay. What I don't want to really do is dominate too much. I want um, this guy to show up and maybe Superman's profile. Let's move this damn can so you can see everything better. So that's what I'm trying to do. Ultimately, what you want to see is the light against the black very well and try to get that down. All right. Now, I'm just thinking right now, thinking out loud, as I always do. Um, we're going to go with Okay. So I'm trying to emphasize colors. Um yeah, these, some of these, I've had these pencils for years. Some of these color pencils I've had for a long time. Okay. Make sure that... has that F0 feel to it, doesn't that music when you finish a race? Okay. Now, what I'm gonna do is treat it like it's paint because I emphasize most of the, uh, the, 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 height, the light spots here and here. So I don't really need to do more than that. So 
So all this, that's it. And I think I'll just make it like a, just a blue. But when I put the blue over the white, that makes a difference. Should be all right. It's not easy. I'm just coming up like I'm thinking about it. It's like, did I do all the right things? I said, oh, see how that goes. Yeah, and I will be working on this for about 32 minutes offline, and then I'll show you updates. I'll work on it for an hour, then two hours, and four hours, and you can see all the progress I can make on this. Because obviously I can make better progress offline. Most of this, the purpose of this is to show you how far I can get, um, I guess, alone. But here, it's the technique. And I've been drawing since I was 14. And I was never that good at it. People have mocked me for years. Even my own father did. Shows you the level of intelligence of people. I mean, they just don't, they don't know how to treat me like a person. It's like, okay. So... Her, her, her visors look lopsided, right? But that's just kind of the way I did it. So you can see her eyes and her face. And it's done in lazy drawing form. And I'm wondering... Hmm... I'm just thinking, I'm thinking of what I could do with this. I think I could make that a solid green, but then, uh, because, so these are the, this, this, this earmuff looking thing is the end of her visor. So what I could do is just add a solid yellow green to it, but it'll be in paint form. And then the rest of it, I could, um, uh, what is this? What is this? Video pause. Continue watching. Yes. Something happened there. Why did we pause? That happened. Pardon me. I'm going to go get the yellow green paint. Because it is paint, and I want to be careful I don't bleed through everything. Um, in fact, in fact, um, I may have to grab a cardboard. So when you work with these acrylic these acrylic type paints, um, what you're trying to do is make sure you don't damage everything. So what I'm actually gonna do is I've been using this notebook to uh, prop this, to get this to uh, sit. So you're seeing it uh, kind of at an angle right now, but I'm gonna make room to paint this right. So actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stand here. We're at 19 minutes. We've got 13 minutes left. So we're spending some time on this. So I am actually going to uh, Okay. 
And that is all you need to do. Now, this is fine especially for those, um, you can kind of see there, I added this here. This is all right, especially for those, um, like if, you, if I had to cut out a small piece of green paper, right? And if you're like, well, what's the point then? If you, you don't need that much. Like you see this, um, you see this small piece of blue. You know, I would like if this were green, I would have to cut it out, but then it's much easier just to do it that way. And because the earmuffs that hold the visors are not exactly, um, they're not uh, front and center. I can kind of like just go ahead and do it that way. So now that I have the notebook off, it might be a little easier. It might not be. Um, but what I'm trying to do is embrace the black more and use that to, uh, uh, I guess, just to make it seem futuristic, I guess. So we have 21 minutes in. And I'm going to try to figure out where the yellow green would be. I have different colors in this one. Uh, let me see what this is. Well, this is a good start. It's yellow green. So what I actually might do is, um, is that yellow? That's not yellow. Let's see what I got over here. I might actually use a yellow first to kind of highlight it. If I don't see it in here, I may have to see how it's constantly going back and forth, grabbing the colors, bringing it over, showing it to you. Oh, we're having a problem here. Oh, that's fine. Here's regular yellow. So I would put some of that in there. And then I want to put some of that green in there. Okay, here's what I would do for this. Let me put a little bit of white to bring that out a little bit better. Because honestly, let me see. Kind of works. We put a little bit of green in this. Make sure that we can actually see that. Okay. It's like a game of chess, I'm thinking here. I'm looking at my colors here. Because I have to draw around, uh, I have to draw around her stuff. Now, I'm not sure where her eyebrows would be. So I'm trying to let that uh, come into her visor. Now her eyes are here, so the eyes are not completely covered by the visor. So it's a little bit like misshapen a bit. That's what I want to do. Let's see. I'm thinking a lot because I have to really, you know, this is, this is now for real, right? Because this is like we're really getting this... Okay. 
Okay. Maybe what I can do for that is maybe combine these two for the eyebrows. I'm thinking for her eyes, it should come out. It should stick out. Her eyes are going to be um, like a some sort of shade of green, but got to be a combination of dark green and uh, like, I don't know, some sort of a weird green. Maybe grass green. Oh, yeah, here's grass green. This is like double-sided. Uh, we'll use the one. So maybe grass green and dark green would be her eyes. I have no idea. Okay. Six more minutes, and I'll show you what I have. So what I'm trying to do is draw that in. Okay. So you can kind of see her face. Could you imagine Henry Cavill is like the senior father character and ends up in this movie? You got these like, like, like the kids, the kids, child actors who play these characters are like 12 years old and then they get a little bit older and they can play these characters. It's just you try to think of it that way. I'm just thinking a lot right now. Um, let's add... For once, okay, and that's going to be some pink residue, and I think we'll use these two. You know, it's how much dark and how much light. Obviously, we want to see the whites of her eyes and her eyes. And I'm thinking of adding another, like this paper here to her face. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that tonight. I don't think it's going to happen. Because all I'm focusing right now is just kind of getting the vision through the visors. So let's make sure we can get that. I might get a TV soon. It would be my first HD TV. That's what I would like to do because I never got one since they've been invented. Um, I'm not going to wait till a Black Friday sale. You know we go for a Black Friday sale for ourselves, right? We don't really do it because we really want to get somebody a present. That's fucking bullshit. We're just trying to like fool ourselves, right? Okay. I'm looking at my options here. Okay. All right. Then you add a little bit. Now, you got the green here in the visor, so you want to respect the green visors. All right, so that's, so I got to finish with the eyebrows. Okay. All right. Let's see. Yeah, don't forget this stuff. Two more minutes. So 
Well, we're not done yet. We're not done yet. I want to show you. Let's add the whites of her eyes, but okay. All right, there is what we have so far, and so the end of her hair is actually here, this point here. She's looking out this way, probably towards Superman. And uh, I like this so far. Um, but I gotta really, really like flesh out her face a little bit better and her neck. And uh, that goes for the others. You know, they're gonna look kind of slightly holographic, but mostly they're on this distant planet because Earth is dead and Superman is a hologram and he tricks everyone into trying to shut him down, which they do. Um, but it's about them living for themselves and not uh, for anyone else. But they do, they are Superman's legacy after all. All right, uh, stay tuned for more updates.